guys welcome back to another recipe episode of in the kitchen with sandy and today i am making something extra special for you guys today i woke up wanted something absolutely amazing but simple wanted something italian so this recipe fits the bill today i'm going to show you how to make um, a very simple recipe um, that is just pasta and garlic and olive oil and a little bit of parmesan cheese I know it doesn't sound like much, but it is absolutely so full of flavor. You know, you've got your olive oil and your garlic, and we're going to drizzle some nice Parmesan cheese right on top, um, a little parsley for color, and it is, I can't even tell you how good this is. It's not a heavy um, pasta with a heavy sauce on it. It's just light, and it's just so aromatic, and it's, it's so delicious. I'm going to take my pasta and just throw it right in the water. For this, I like to keep my pasta whole. Um, and you want to let your pasta just kind of go down into the water itself. You don't want to really push it down. It just kind of gets in there and does its magic. Does its magic, I tell you. We're going to add a little bit of salt to this water. And you want your pasta um, al dente for this recipe. I like it al dente for the recipe anyway. But what I've got here is some sliced garlic and um, some parsley. That's all that we're going to use in this. A little bit of red pepper, fresh red pepper flakes, and some Parmesan cheese that we're just going to incorporate right into that. What I want you to do is start your pan out um, cold. We don't want your pan hot at this point in time, but we're going to add some olive oil to this. And you're going to add a generous amount of olive oil because this is going to be your sauce for your pasta. Oh, it's so delicious. So delicious. And then you go ahead and turn that on um, about medium and you're going to throw your garlic in there you want your garlic to start out in in the cold oil so it can infuse all of that beautiful garlic flavor and then we're just going to give this a nice toss This comes together so quickly, and like I said, it's so light, and it's so easy to make, and it's so, so absolutely delicious. And while that's coming up to temperature, I'm just going to go ahead and stir my pasta again. Now again, you want your pasta al dente. You don't um, want to overcook it. And again, what you're doing here by adding your garlic to your cold olive oil is you are allowing all that garlic deliciousness to infuse right into your oil, which is going to make this absolutely amazing. And then we're going to go ahead and throw in add just a little bit of crushed red pepper flakes just for heat. It's, it's going to add just the right amount of heat. It's also going to add a beautiful flavor to it as well. Mmm. Now I'm going to test my pasta for doneness. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off because it's probably getting close to being done. Because like I said, you want that to go in al dente. Mmm. That's perfect. Now what you're going to do is you're just going to add your pasta right in. And the reason I like to do it this way is because you're adding some of that pasta water right in there, which is going to add some delicious lusciousness to this dish. Look at that, how beautiful that is. I, I don't like to drain my pasta for this dish this because I like to use some of the water for that. Look how beautiful that is. We're going to push that to the side there. And then now you're going to add a generous amount of parsley. Look at that. Oh nice generous amount and we're going to give that a toss oh it's, it's so infused with all of that beautiful garlic and olive oil look at that look at that how gorgeous is that and then we're going to add of course, a couple tablespoons of Parmesan cheese. 
And if you notice, I didn't add any extra um, salt to my pasta. Let's go ahead and do three. Why not, right? And that's because the Parmesan cheese has a nice salty content to it. You know what, guys? I've got to find my tongs. Mm, just kind of stir that in together. Look at that beautiful garlic. Lost one there. Oh, my. And now we're just going to plate this up. I told you it was simple and easy, didn't I? Look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Mmm. This dish would make anyone, any Italian proud, that's for sure. And we're going to go back over it with a little bit more parsley for color. And of course, a little bit more cheese. Why not, right? Now here's the true test. Simple and easy as always. I like to keep things simple and easy here. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. This is so, so delicious. Oh my goodness. I can't even tell you how good this is. See, didn't I tell you it was going to be easy? Mm. Pasta makes me so happy. Always. Mm. I certainly hope you give this recipe a try very soon. You will thank me for it. No two better things come together than garlic and olive oil. Am I right or am I right? Hmm. You know I love you so much. If I didn't, I wouldn't be doing these videos. I appreciate you all for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next recipe episode. Bye. I love this.